No, that is inaccurate. I came here principally to protect Kale. You most certainly did not. Kale's been here on the quiet numerous times, and this is the first time you felt the need to join. Not only me. Sim applies to you too, doesn't it? <laughs> if my writer friend were here now, I'm sure he would describe this curious coincidence as having the makings of a good story. It's always a pleasure to meet a fan. Oh, here he comes! Wait, you mean you're Mr. Calx? Having my new friends address me by my pen name feels... Uh, somewhat unusual. Please, just call me Albedo. Huh. So you're Calx. Sino's been talking about you non-stop recently. He's intent on getting you to design a bespoke card back for him. Uh, you didn't have to say all that. I don't usually take private commissions, but... I believe that we are friends now, all of us. Our conversations have been deep and interesting. And Sino, your passion for this game is indeed one of a kind. I can see it in your eyes. <laughs> Obviously. And given that you've come all this way from Sumeru to see me, I'd be quite honored to take this commission. Wow, your teacher's so nice. I feel the same about yours. Um, well, they definitely have different personalities, but they're similar when it comes to their character. So? How much should I budget for the timeless masterpiece you will produce for me? Surely, timeless masterpiece is something of an overstatement. Any artwork fit to appear on the reverse of my card decks is by definition a timeless masterpiece. Even if I do say so myself. Don't mind him. These TCG nutjobs are all like this. I see. So, this has an almost religious significance. Well, for starters, I'd like to hear a few more of your jokes. Uh, my jokes? You like them? I do. Really? I didn't see you laughing. Well, the joke's ability to induce laughter is a separate matter, but I certainly find them fun. If I might interrupt, does anyone else smell something strange? Uh, my nutritional meal! Will it be okay? Should we go over and take a look too? Yeah. <laughs>